If you are getting an error message when trying to launch Starfield on your Windows computer saying that your graphics card doesn't meet the minimum specs or it's giving you some other graphics error message, perhaps it says your driver isn't up to date or something like that, then don't panic because there's an easy way of resolving these issues. So the first thing that I'm going to suggest you do is download a program called Easy Game Utility. Once you've downloaded it, clicking on the link in the description below, you need to go to the Clean tab. And once you're on this tab, just go all the way to the bottom and then click on clean next to your graphics card. So I've got an AMD graphics card, which means I'd need to click on clean and then go OK. And this is just going to clear out all the cache files for my graphics card. Once you've done that, go ahead and try and launch the game again and see if that resolved the issue that you're having. If it didn't, then the next thing that you need to do is open up the Windows updates and ensure you have the latest update installed for your Windows computer. So right click on the system icon or Windows icon in the bottom left hand corner and go to settings. You then need to click on update and security and then click on the check for updates button. Once you've updated Windows, the next thing that you need to do is also install the latest driver for your graphics card. So if you've got an NVIDIA graphics card, you'd need to go to the NVIDIA website, AMD, AMD website, Intel, Intel website. So I have popped the links in the description below and also some guides on how you can update your driver. So this is what the Intel website looks like. Once you're on this site, you'd need to click on graphics. You then need to find out what graphics card you have. If you're not sure, you can right click on the start menu icon and then go to device manager. Once you've selected Device Manager, you then need to expand Display Adapters. You will then see your graphics card and model number and everything that you need to know there. You can then find your graphics card driver by clicking in search and then just search for the name. As for NVIDIA, again, it would be the same here. So in Device Manager, it would say something like NVIDIA GTX 960 or 1660 Super or whatever you've got or an RTX 40 series, so a 4060 or something. You would then go to the NVIDIA website, you would then select 40 series, and you would then select um, like 4060 for example there, product series, and then you would then select um, product, oh, I'm getting confused there, sorry. Then you would select your operating system and then make sure you select the game ready driver. Go search, and you would then just click on download and then install the latest driver for your graphics card. Again with AMD, so I've actually got an AMD graphics card. So I'll go to Device Manager, I've got an RX 6750 XT, which means I need to find that in this list here. So 6000, and then again if I go to Device Manager, you can see it's 750 XT. So I'd select the 7000, and then 750 XT there, and then go Submit. I'd then select my operating system, so Windows 10, and then just click on download and install the latest driver. You can also select this option here if you prefer, if you don't want to do the auto detect. So that's it. Once you've installed the latest driver for your graphics card, updated Windows, cleared those cache files for your graphics card, launched Starfield, and that would have resolved the issues that you're having with the graphics error messages. So I hope this video did help you out and you enjoyed the video. If you did, click the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish videos.